Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. This is Taisha with Organized Plans. I want to start by thanking all of my subscribers for spending some time with me today. And if you're new to my channel and haven't subscribed yet, I would love to have you. In today's video, I'm going to be creating a fun back to school shopping insert page to go into my planner to keep me on track for all of the back to school shopping that I need to do. So if you'd like to join me for this plan with me, then let's get started. So I have pulled a few different sticker books that I have found um, that have some great back to school stickers. And so that's what I have in front of me, uh, a along with a uh, just piece of um, filler paper. This just came in a pack, um, some that were dotted line. And then, then this sheet is um, kind of a grid. Um, line and I think that will be perfect for back to school and I also have this um, washi that I'm going to use. This came um, as part of a seasonal washi pack from um, Hobby Lobby I got a couple years ago but I do still see this in the stores from time to time um, so that is um, what I'll be using to create this insert. So um, in terms of the sticker books, I have a few, as I said, this one is the latest seasonal teacher sticker book. Um, it came out as part of the back to school release from 2023. Um, here's the season sticker book um, that was from last year. Uh, Fresh start teacher. This was from um, the 2022 um, uh, back to school release. Another um, seasonal sticker book called Cheerful Seasons from last year. And then finally, the Squad um, Goal sticker book, Love Every Season. Um, I thought I would pull in some girls um, for this spread as well. So those will be all the books that I'm using. So as usual, I'm just going to start by um, grabbing some wax paper and um, collecting my stickers. And, and that way I can have everything um, nearby and just want to try to um, zoom in just a touch so you can see everything. Okay, so um, out of these sticker books, I'm pulling um, a few different things here and there. So from the Happy Planner Love Every Season in this fall section, I love this girl. She looks like she's a teacher. <laughs> so, um, uh, or a parent, I guess, or just a girl. So, um, but I thought that would be cute uh, to go onto the page. So that's what I'm gonna pull out of this book. And yeah, I think that is it from here. And then along with that um, is going to be um, this from the seasonal teacher where most of the stickers that I wanted to use this um, page right at the front. Um, here's to the best school year ever. Teach, mentor, inspire. I just love these ones and I think um, we'll make for cute decoration around the page with the different pencils and just super cute. So just gonna pull these different decorative pieces. And I hope everyone is doing well. And I'm definitely interested to hear if you're doing any back to school shopping for um, kids or grandkids. Um, my two kids are in college. So um, most of everything that they need, um, you know, their different books, um, they're getting from the bookstore or they are ordered um, online and can um, like do the uh, rental from Amazon. Um, so it's, um, so that works out pretty well, but I'll still pick up um, a few things here and there just in terms of um, notebooks and um, papers and, you know, pencils and things like that. Um, Okay, so I love that. Um, grabbed a bunch out of that page, and then I have a few more. Um, and 
just trying to think. I really love this red box and it just says take note. Um, and I think that will work well with the apples. So that's the end of that section. I think that's all I'm gonna need out of that book. Um, and then for the fresh start, um, this is a great teacher sticker book um, or just sticker book in general. I'm not a teacher, but um, I think it has a lot of great um, boxes and functional stickers and goals and so forth that you can definitely use some great quotes and so on, even if you are not a teacher. Um, so I was actually looking at this box too. Huh. And I don't think I'm going to need two long boxes. And I don't know, maybe this will go a little bit better. Um, I mean, I guess either could really work. But I kind of like this yellow. It kind of matches a little bit with the, um, with the pencils. So maybe I'll use this one instead. It does say weekly to do. And maybe I can try to get a box just to cover up that wording. Um, like I could do this red here. That could work. Maybe the blue. That could work as well. And I did like um, that pencil that I saw, uh, those set of pencils towards the front. Yeah, this um, today's priorities, today's to do. I wish it had, well, it's in gold foil. Uh, let's see. We have some regular pencils without any wording. More Apple stickers. Um, maybe I'll pull these blue ones too with the red. Just lots of fun little apples. Okay. All right, so. I think this today's to-dos is the one I'm gonna pull. Okay, so that's great. And then um, a few more little pieces that I I saw from the Cheerful Seasons. Um, and I've used some of this last year, but um, this little back to school section with the backpack and the school bus. Um, that's really cute. Um, so let me just grab a few of these. Maybe the scissors as well. The globe is cute. And the backpack. Got a lot here. <laughs> okay, that's cute. I love that school bus. Um, and then out of the season sticker book, this was kind of the back to school page and um, love this like little ruler. So let me grab that too. How fun. I know for me and this sticker that says back to school, I think that is perfect, the perfect little touch. So. Um, I think that's everything um, that I'm going to pull from these books. And so I know for me growing up, I'm originally from New Jersey, and we always went back to school um, after the Labor Day holiday. But living in North Carolina, you know, would go to school around, start back to school around middle of August. And that was definitely an adjustment, um, you know, for for me. I felt like um, school, you know, I couldn't think about school until after Labor Day. But, um, and especially, it's just still so hot um, outside here. And I know some states 
um, had students that went back to school like at the end of July. So it's just really interesting, um, you know, how that all works. But um, so I think I'm gonna start with just putting down this washi tape at the bottom. And it just has these great decorations, um, little school icons going across. And that's fun. And then I will um, trim off the sides. I don't think I'm gonna use a ton of, ton of washi. I just wanted to have this at the bottom. Okay. And then I'm going to put um, thinking about should I put it right in the center um, whoop, don't go down <laughs> it's like jumping out of my hand okay let's try that again all right uh, let's see okay so maybe I'll actually use both boxes just to Anchor, uh, maybe I'll use both boxes. Okay, so I have that one down. Maybe I can do kind of one list for my son, another list for my daughter. So I think I wanna use both of these. Um, so that will go next. All right. And I do wanna kind of white out that weekly to do just so I don't see that darker lettering under the box and I think I am going to do the navy just right right over top of it right filling in okay I think that works. And then how about, here's the best school year. Okay. And then I think I wanna just kind of go around with the rest of, oh, I forgot the girl. <laughs> Let me put the, the girl down here. So how about, uh, about here and so I think I'm gonna need to maybe white out behind her let's see if I put her here I won't have to um, but I think I like her here okay so I am going to just grab my white out and just go right along the edge, maybe to there. And let's see if that works. Just gonna grab my tweezers. Okay, okay. Let's put her there. That looks great. And now, just kind of decorate. Maybe I'll put this one here. And I'm just looking at the rest of the little pieces that I have and how I want to kind of fill in with them. I know also when my kids were in um, kind of grade school and um, or elementary school and then high school, um, one of the things that they started doing was um, instead of having to do back to school shopping um, yourself, you could just pay a set 
amount um, and everything would be ordered um, and delivered to the school. And that was like everything that was needed. So I have heard, um, you know, some schools doing that. And I know that was a great help um, just to make sure, you know, you were getting everything on the list that was needed and um, you didn't have to, you know, kind of be, uh, you know, go to all the different stores and everything. So I kind of like it um, <laughs> myself, but I know everyone doesn't. So um, it's, uh, you know, some different options out there, which I think are, you know, work for families. Um, so maybe I should move this one instead of putting that one there. Put this back to school in the corner here. Okay, that looks cute. And then just want to keep filling in throughout. little pieces as I go and have the ruler as well love how this is coming together So fun. We did um, also just get my daughter a new iPad and Apple Pencil. She did um, her freshman year, got an Apple um, a MacBook Pro. And so we did get that for her. So she's pretty set <laughs> outside of a few things here and there. Um, but yeah, I think she'll be in good order. So I'm just gonna look back and see if there's any other little pieces I wanna bring in. Maybe. Another little pencil could do. Pencil up. So definitely would love to know if your kids or family, grandkids are already back to school or not, if you're still out, you know, doing shopping and everything, um, and how that is working for you. Okay, I think this is super cute. So I think I'm gonna, um, I'm really glad I went with both of the lists because they may need some different things. And um, and so now I'll have, you know, kind of two lists for both kids and um, that will work out well. I'm just looking at these two blue um, apples and they're kind of right across from each other. So maybe I will shift a few of these things up and that way I can kind of maybe put the apple lower. Um, okay. Um, I'm 
like the little push pin. Just grab that too. Then the paper clip. Kind of stick that in there. And just seeing if there's A little notebook that could work okay I think that's gonna do it um, really fun I think this is gonna be great I can pop this right into my planner as I take this with me out to the stores or just at least have um, you know a place to write down the different items and to keep me organized so um, as I said I'd love to hear you know how things are going for all of you in terms of getting families ready for back to school I thank you all so much for watching and uh, if you like this video click that like button and give me a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe and I hope you all have a great day bye friends Ooh.